Much of the work now going on at Nybeck had its inspiration nearly 40 years ago in the work of one of Northern Ireland's most famous and successful innovators, Professor Frank Pantridge. In the early days when, when Frank was setting up cardiology you know, at the Royal Victoria Hospital, he began to realise that most of his patients were dying outside hospital or in the home or somewhere else. 60% of the deaths were occurring within the first hour after the onset of chest pain. Professor Pantridge's solution was simple but groundbreaking. Instead of transporting the patient to the treatment, he would bring the treatment to the patient, saving time and, of course, lives. And so, in the mid-60s, the first cardiac ambulance in the world took to the streets of Belfast, and the first move had been made towards bringing the point of care from hospital to patient. Well, speed is the all-important uh, thing in this kind of case, because the longer we leave someone outside hospital with a coronary thrombosis, uh, the more likely they are to develop within the early hours of the onset of symptoms. But there was a snag. The machines the team needed, particularly the defibrillator that can shock the heart back into action, were simply too big for the job. Already the need to miniaturise was clear, but it was easier said than done. This was a team that really was ahead of its time. The materials they needed simply didn't exist. And that was the inspiration behind the founding of Nybeck. 